What have you kids gotten me into this time? Apparently this is a game where you pretend to be a goat? Which honestly doesn't sound half bad, I, I guess. I'm just, well, I, I guess I'm just disappointed in your entire generation is all. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. So it seems I've made my way out onto a street. You know, so far so good. I'm really starting to feel like I am the goat, you know? Whoa, hey, watch where you're going, buddy. Let's see what some of these buttons do. Oh, apparently that's the murder button. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry, strange man who wants his mommy. Uh, just give me a second to find the button that'll release my tongue from your... Oh, ow! Boy, I'll tell you folks what. I just do not have a beat on these controls yet. So far, there's a murder button and a jump in front of a truck button. Jiminy Christmas, I'm afraid to try any more buttons. A tongue release button might be nice, though. Kind of feel bad for this guy. Something tells me he wasn't planning on becoming a corpse balloon when he went out on his walk this morning. <laughs> Boy, they don't build swimming pools like this anymore, do they? Why, I remember back in the day, our neighborhood had a high dive so tall that it was pretty much granted that you'd lose a tooth or two every time you hit the water. I tell you, those were the days. We didn't have a slide like this, though. This is remarkable. Well, seeing as how I've mastered sliding on my butt, I suppose there's only one thing left to do. Geronimo! Oh, oh, ah! Oh, he seems to be scared to slide down it. Can't say I blame him, seeing as how there's no water. Great, looks like I have another corpse balloon attached to my tongue. For the life of me, I cannot figure out how to detach my tongue from his. Hmm, maybe if I, maybe if I just stretch my, my tongue far enough, I'll, I'll have to come off. I, I mean, it, it can't stretch forever, can it? Can it? Holy Toledo, that tongue's gonna be sore in the morning. I guess we'll just roll with this and see how far it stretches. But jeez, this game is strange. And, and worst of all, I feel like this is hardly what being a goat is like at all. Wait, what? What just, huh? Holy moly, what in the Sam Hill is happening to this goat? That's it. We just reached a whole new dimension of weird that I don't want any part of. We got number ones getting intermixed with spelled out ones and laws of physics are being broken and I, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I, I'm done. I want off. I want off. Whew, sorry. Just need a moment to catch my breath and wind down. Gosh. You kids have really gone and done it this time, haven't you? Now, look, I just feel like at this point, I, I want to make one thing abundantly clear. I am never playing a game with goats again, okay? So don't even try suggesting it. And don't think you're going to be cute either. I heard that you can play as a, as a dog-goat creature in one of the Call of Duty games. So don't try pulling a fast one with old Grandpa Lemon or all pwn you noobs. Also, don't forget to like this video, uh, you know, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. I mean, I don't know how else you're seeing this video because all the videos end up on the front page, right? <laughs> no, they don't. We're just kidding. We're joking. But, uh, yeah, as always, my name's Grandpa Lemon, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. All right.